What's going on guys? Welcome to another episode of CD in the Universe. This one, however, is a special episode because it's our first unboxing episode. I'm D. I'm C. C's here. He's <laughs> just hanging out. And I thought it would be fun to do some snacks and talk about what they taste like. So I got a Tokyo treat and I'm really excited about it because it looks really cool and I think the United States Customs like beat the ever loving shit out of this box because it's pretty wrecked. Like, I don't know if you can see it or not, but on the front it says received in damaged condition at the Limestone Post Office. So thanks a lot, Limestone Post Office. Here's a shout out <laughs> to you guys. Alright, so we got a fun little orange box. Let's crack on in. But first, it says we should get five candies, two biscuits, a chips, and a drink, five chocolates, a rice cracker, and no meat. Let's see if all that shit's actually in here. Well, that seems uh, like a lot of stuff. Yeah, it's a lot of stuff. I'm step, hoping it's like... Funky. Step up your game, Loot Crate. <laughs> uh, C's going to be doing Loot Crate whenever those finally uh, get in. <laughs> What's, uh, what you're excited about next month's theme? What is it? Uh, it's, uh... Oh, it's so cute! Like, futuristic. It's kawaii as shit, y'all. Check out this business. Oh my god, there's so much stuff. Alright, cool. So, it comes with this, like, cool little book. And it's, like, talking about the, the neat stuff that's, like, in it. Like, you can get a small, regular, or premium and i wasn't for sure if it would actually make it to the us or not but it did so i might look into getting one besides the small which is what i got it's pretty dope anyways it's a nice little look at the inside of the tokyo treat and looks like uh first we got some kind of i'm guessing milk and biscuit something or another uh so Let's crack on in and see how this bad boy tastes. What do you think it tastes like, see? Uh, I'm sure it tastes nasty. <laughs> nasty? Nah, I'm... It smells good. It's gonna be delicious. It smells like, um... Like old Lay's potato chips. <laughs> Alright. I'm hoping <laughs> it's flavored like milk and a biscuit. Are they chips? Mm -hmm. They're kind of like, they, they kind of taste like sweet milk. Just a straight up like, that's good. These are actually really good. <laughs> All right, well. Moving on. Awesome. Next item. That was dope. Uh, we got a bunch of roofies. I uh, don't know what these are, but they. I hope they're like sixlets. You like sixlets? I used to until I got some nasty ones. Sixlets are dope. So these go bad in November of 2017, so they last a while. And it looks like they all have different flavors, so I'm going to try like a few of them. Yeah, it's straight up it's a six lit. <laughs> awesome. Well, Thanks, Japan, really good. I'm for try reinventing the, <laughs> the six lit. Let's see if this shit's any good or not. Yep, this is awesome. This is, so, it took a while to get here. I was really hoping that nothing melted, and it didn't. It held up really well, so. Great job, Tokyo Treat. We really appreciate this. You were really good. Shit. So C was kind enough to point out that our friends at Tokyo Treat are very smart people and they know that we, me, is not that smart. I'm pretty dense, guys. So, these are actually fortune-telling chocolate pills. And each of these are like a little description of like a part of your life, like, say love or your future marriage stuff like that and you pop them out and then it's got a thing on it that tells you 
if it's very good, good, not good, or bad. So they taste like cichlids, cichlids or whatever. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, we'll figure out one. So you wanna toss me a random number between one and 18? Let's do uh, lucky number 13. Number 13 is date. Let's see how my date's gonna go, everybody. Okay, it's out. The date is going to be pretty decent. <laughs> Give me another one, man. That was a good. All right, what's well, uh, let's do one for me. Let's pick number uh number eleven. Eleven is your exam. <laughs> <laughs> Great, that exam I'm not taking. <laughs> it's for uh your certification classes. <laughs> All right, let's see how your cert's going to go. Oh, that's a double circle. Bad. <laughs> Not too good. Um, how about for CD in the universe? Let's see how that's going to be with number 18 for future. <laughs> double square or double X, whatever bad is. Double bad. What is it? Double circle. Oh, hell yeah. Like and subscribe, guys. You got to make these tasty candies. <laughs> <laughs> Holy fuck. Take a look at this shit. See what that is? That's mm. some fucking Pokemon gummies. I am... <laughs> Looks like we have a grapefruit flavor, a lemon, which somehow equals a tangerine, I believe. <laughs> like, so we got some combinations. So let's bust on up in here. I was kind of hoping they have some funky shit, but so far it's all actually just been like really good. It tastes like a ramenay. You ever had ramenay? Just good. I have to get you on this. Alright, well, fuck. This shit's goddamn delicious. Whoa. Hmm. These just fruity gummies. That one tastes like ramen. The other one was kind of like peachy. These are a little pine solly. <laughs> That's a good one. That's what I was hoping for. Alright. So... There's a guy in here that I've been eyeballing. I think I'm going to make C try some of these. Cause I'm pretty sure I've had them before. And they're pretty dope. But I think we got some sh shrimp chips. <laughs> <laughs> I think I've heard of those. They're, uh, they're pretty good. Oh. Mmm. <laughs> Boy, they... Here, come on over here for a second. Have you a little whiff of this? Get a little smell of the... Mmm. <laughs> yeah. All right. Let's see if these bad boys live up to the, uh, the odor. <laughs> well, that's... Man, fun. you're four items in. <laughs> you're bound to get a bad one. They're not bad. They're just, like... If you guys have ever been like near a like a Long John Silver's or a Captain D's on a day when it smelled funky, you imagine like a Funyun that has that flavor, like that odor of like a seafood restaurant. You just, I can't stop eating them though, because now they they kind of taste like a Cheeto a little bit. There you go. All right, man. Well, those bad boys over. To try one of those. They kind of taste like a bugle. A really nasty bugle. Next one! <laughs> Alright. I'm no stranger to Pocky, but I have not had the Brazilian orange kind. It's got a little toucan on it. I crack your shit open. Shit, I've never had a uh, Pocky. Pocky? No, ever. Dude, Pocky's 
dope as fuck. I've always seen them and always wanted to buy them, but never do. My fingers are all slippery from them <laughs> shrimp chips. No shit, Pocky's fucking dope. If you guys have never had Pocky, you're missing out. And if you live in like a shitty area like we do, you can get it from Walmart. Oh, it's tangy and delicious. What is this? What is this flavor? Reminds me of something. You look like you want one. You guys want one? Guys, you should leave us a like if you want me to give Steve one of these. Because he's not going to get one until I get a like. Oh, it's a uh, dreamsicle. It tastes like dreamsicle. Oh, shit. Got? Have a giant. Oh, yeah. <laughs> smashed up one. Look at that bad boy. So here you go, guys. This is uh, Steve's first time eating Pocky. He's... Very, very dope down with it. <laughs> oh, he looks so happy. <laughs> All right. Let's see what else is in the treat. The wrapping paper. Ah, uh, okay. Well, from where the bottom had been, like, fucked up and kicked in, I thought there was some more stuff. But there could be more stuff next time, because this is really good. I'm pretty sure I'm actually going to get the premium. If you guys uh, are interested in this, just uh, go check out Tokyo Treat. Hop in your computer, do a little Tokyo Treat search. We might even pop in the link. Just so go check it out. Uh, we're not paid to do this. We just wanted to. And everything is really good. The shrimp chips were questionable, but I'm pretty sure if you like seafood, <laughs> you, mm, yeah, they're okay. <laughs> and I guess we'll see you guys in our next video. Bye guys. See ya.